this video we are going to see how to install VAM server in Windows 10 64 bit operating system. So for that first we have to go to google google.com and type VAM um, download for Windows 10 64 bit. So you will get the official website. So in that website, if you click that website, it will redirect to VAM server official website. There you can see download directly link. So if you click that one, it will redirect to another one page. There it will be automatically downloaded. So once it is downloaded, Once it is downloaded, you can install it from the downloaded location. So if you double click that one, you can easily install that VAM server 64 bit OS. So now we are going to install it one. So click next. So choose the file location. So if you want to install the VAM server in C drive then you can choose the location I am going to install my VAM server in E location so I have chosen the file location here so now click the next button Now installation is completed. It is showing an error. MSVCR120.dll is missing. So if you click that one. So continuously I am getting the error. So we are going to solve this one. So for solving these errors. For rectifying this error. So first what we are going to do is. We are going to download all the DLL files from the Google. First we are going to. Download VCR runtime 140.dll. So, if you type that one in the Google, you can get the DLL files. So, there you can download the appropriate DLL file for 64 bit OS. So, if you cl click the download, you can get the file here. So, Another way to download the VCR runtime 140.dll is so if you go to this website you can download VCR runtime 140.dll so in this way also you can download the VCR runtime 140.dll file. Once VCR runtime 140 DLL, DLL is downloaded, uh, now the local host is working. 
but the it is not going to php my admin so it is not working php my admin so remaining files also we need to download msvcr120.dll so if you type that one in google you can get the dll files so two dll files are there for windows 10 64 bit that is 64 bit os so that two files can be downloaded and that two files can be installed so that is so we have downloaded the msvcr120.dll so here it is downloading so once it is downloaded we have to extract that one We have to extract both the files and so inside the folder you can get the DLL files. You have to copy the DLL file and go to C drive Windows System32 then click System32 System32 there you can paste the DLL file. Next we are going to download msvcp120.dll file. So Google if you type that file you can get the corresponding DLL files. So in that file we have to download the 64 bit DLL file. So once it is downloaded we have to extract that file. Inside the folder you can get the DLL file. So you can copy the DLL file and paste it inside the C drive Windows System32 folder so these three file has to be downloaded and it should be pasted inside the System32 folder <music> Once all the three DLL files are downloaded and uh, pasted in the Windows System32 folder, then we have to uninstall the uh, previously installed VAM server. Then we have to install, reinstall the VAM server. Then we have to restart the computer. Then, then run the VAM server means that error will be solved so the sql uh, mysql also will be worked properly 